My name is Christine and I'm a full-time mom with three lovely kids. Today, I would like to take this opportunity to share with everyone my personal finance. So, um, let me bring you back a bit with the time machine. So, basically, when we were young, I remember when my dad came back with his payday and his salary day. So, he would pass my mom some of his uh, allowance, so-called, for household or whichever purpose. So, um, whenever we need money, my mom will just automatically from the kitchen came out and she said, oh, this is the fee for your school fees or she came out from the bedroom or anywhere with the money. So sometimes we'll have uh, times that we need to do treasure hunt because she forgot where she kept her money. So we will hunt for it, uh, maybe in the kitchen, in the cookie tin or somewhere else, all of a sudden we found it. So that's where that I realized that we can only have an emergency fund in a specific Space, which we can uh, get easily or perhaps we can just put in our bank account or currently we have easy access like we have uh, all these uh, e-wallet, uh, drone pay or do it now so it's easier to have all these uh, fund transfer instead of keeping uh, cash in your house aside from that when during my secondary uh, we used to watch this Hong Kong movie. So it's a Hong Kong drama movie. Basically, it's a, a 60 or 30 episode. So that's one movie that we really love it. It's about share market. So from there onwards, uh, we actually thought of investing share market. And we have no idea. We just buy knowledge not no knowledge at all we just watch movie and then we think that we should invest so me and my parents just took up some money and then invest in share market and luckily we had uh, the first time that we invested in share market we actually double up our investment so we got a bit of greed so called so we tried the second round and at the time because of no knowledge or any uh, experience so we didn't know that there's broker fees or uh, other hidden fees and also when the market was down we actually didn't know how to let go we actually wait until it um, hiked back which it doesn't and we lose a lot of money that time and it was a bad hit throughout our family basically so that's where that whenever you want to invest please have a little bit knowledge or do some research instead of just blindly go into the market itself and currently there's a lot of like robo advisor that you can just um, go in with a really minimum um, um, cost of commissions or whichever fees hidden fees so it's pretty transparent nowadays so ask for the whatever fees that you have for the investment before you invest or request for lower fees they are allowed to do that so aside from that saving is very important so I um, eat in like especially nowadays with the COVID hit so cook at home eat less outside and you can save and also wisely spend spend on things that you really need if you really doesn't need it and you feel just crave of buying it so you might also call a friend share with them whether is it necessary to have it or something like that so um, aside from that is diversify your portfolio so aside from emergency funds you need to have emergency funds no matter how you wouldn't know when do you need the money if let's say you lock, lock it into like unit trust or somewhere which when you remove the, when you need, need the money and you take it out that's where the, you lost a chunk of it so wisely spend and also uh, diversify your portfolio. Aside from that, um, for those that have young kids at home, I always um, like to introduce them, guide them to save. So I normally buy a Christmas gift for them every year. So year end, when there's a lot of uh, it's, uh, food in their piggy bank, uh, this saving piggy bank, so uh, I'll bring them to the bank to uh, to save it in their current account. So, do you want to share? <laughs> yeah. 
we will share the the bring them to the uh bank together as let them experience saving together. Okay, I think um that's all for now. Make it a habit for your kids to save. And it's interesting, some even do you like to save money? Hmm. Or you like to buy? <laughs> so you buy later, you save now, okay? Alright. You what is my sister? Terima? Nandri. Sisi Bye.